Hola mis amores. Hope you guys are having a wonderful day today. I know I am. I feel so fabulous. I feel so energetic. I feel so refreshed today. A lot of you in my previous video asked me what kind of skincare I use. So what I use is I use the the three in one. The th not three in one. The the artistry hydrating one. So every morning and every night I use it. So what I do in the morning is I just, I wash my face. I like you can tell I already washed my face. Then I apply the toner, which is this, which, which, is, which what, is what you guys saw. And then I start cleaning my face. And I start doing this to my face. And I do it all over. Then I do it, like I said, you always have to take care of your neck. I do it on my neck. And you guys could tell, even though I thought I was clean, I was a little, I was very, very dirty. And what I do is I use the other side and I start doing the same. And I do the same. And on my neck. And now I am clean. After that, I apply the Artistry Hydrating V, Hydrating V lotion. So you know how much you apply. I do about this much. Oh, it fell. It's okay. I do about this much. I rub it on my fingers and then I dab it all over. On my neck also, everything has to go. And then I start hydrating my face. Like that, like that. I start doing this. And my nails, because that's where I get most oily. My T-zone. And my mouth, around my mouth. And then on my neck, I apply, I apply, then I let it set for a while. <laughs> I fan it also. So when I feel it, that it's about dry, it takes about 30 seconds. Sorry, my baby hair. I apply my primer, like you guys know, I like the MAC primer. I apply two dabs of that, two pumps, I mean, I go here, 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 and then I start rubbing all over my eyes, my mouth, my neck. And then I fan again. <laughs> I fan, 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 fan. After that, it's still wet. I could tell, I could tell it's still wet. I touch myself. It's still wet. I like it when it's dry. I go in with my artist artistry longwear the color i use is neutral i'm not too sure if you guys can see neutral the color i use on my face um i do three pumps of foundation because i like my whole face to be covered and I also use the Artistry Ideal Radiant. And this is in the color Light Medium. I go like this. I think it's about a pump, I'll say. If you could tell. Then I mix it. 
I mix it and then I start applying all over my face on my eyes on my forehead you can't forget down here okay then I start blending it in I use the dab technique I dab 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 doop, doop. I don't know why every time I do foundation, it always goes on my hair. Like literally, it's like my my hair also wants some sort of foundation on it itself. And then I dab, 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 dab. Because you want it to set perfectly on your face. Especially around the corners of your eyes. Around the bottom of your eye. I don't use concealer. I know a lot of people use concealer, but I don't use concealer as much. Only when I'm extremely tired. And I feel like, I don't know. I guess I'm not really used to it. So that's why I feel like I don't really like concealer. Or maybe I haven't found the right concealer. If you guys know any good concealer, let me know in the comments below. And what you guys think about the concealer. What kind of concealer I should use. Or if you guys think I should even, I even need concealer. And this is how my face looks. Let me do a close-up. This is how my face looks. After I'm done the foundation. Then I go in with, because I like a glowy look. I always like the glow, if you can style, of the highlighters. I go in with the L'Oreal Lumi. And this is the color Light Glow 902. I go in with that color. I do like that much a dab. <laughs> I'm not really sure with that one to be honest with you guys how much I do I just do like a little it looks like when you do macarons and then I apply it on the areas I want to apply it. and I want the most glow one it's like if you guys see I don't apply it all over my face I only apply in the area I want the most glow and the most shine which will be my nose my cheekbones, under my eyes. I will apply in my eyes also. And then over here, over here. And there is the glow event. If you guys could tell, look, it looks fabulous. Oh, wait. <laughs> sorry it looks fabulous look how fabulous it looks like i could stop here and be like this is my natural look but i don't want to scare people away so i continue on then i go with the artistry loose powder this is the light and one thing i like about this because i don't know it reminds me of the olden times i like the whole brush not the brush the um, thing i forgot what it's called it looks so like it reminds me of my grandma when she used to do her makeup and the, like the kit that she used to use it used to be something like this so i don't know i think that's why i like this because it reminds me of my grandma and i i don't have my grandma with me so for all of you that still do have your grandma take care of them take they're the best if i still have my grandma <laughs> A lot of things I'll say to her but what I do here is I go under my eyes that's where I want it more here here in my forehead and then 
I just go like this sometimes. Look at that. I dub everything. And I set it because I don't want my foundation to run or I don't want to get oily during the day. And that's what I do. If you guys could tell, I don't use a lot. I just use the bare minimum just to apply and set my face. And then what I do is just go like this to clean it off with a brush. You can use any facial brush. I just like using this microfiber brush. And there. After that, I should stop saying after. I use the, I should clean this. I use the Chanel, so dirty. You guys could tell. The Soleil Tan de Chanel. Bronzer Universal. I use this. And, sorry guys. I'm using a small table, that's why everything is like so compact. And then I start going like this. <laughs> everything is flying everywhere now. Going like this. Here on the temples on my, my brows. Up here, down here, here, then I go a little bit more here, here, and then I start blending. So I start blending. I'll pick it up. Start blending up here. Then I do this. And in here. And I go here. There. There. What I do here is I do like a number three. If you guys could tell, I just blend here. I blend very well here, and then after that, I blend, I go here, and then here. So I do a number three, and then I go to the other side, I blend, blend, then I go here, and then I go down here. And that's how I contour my face. After. What I'll use next is the Artistry Studio Baco Edition. This one, isn't it so cute? I like the design of Artistry. They really, 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 ca it caused my attention. Like, look how adorable that is. It's like so cute. And what I do is I use this color plus this color. I do like dab 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 and this time I need a brush. And I dab 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 on my face. Dab 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 on my face. Then I blend. I go again. I go dab 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 on my face. Then, you see if you could tell, I didn't take it out. I highlight using my highlighter. And I know people do the highlight at the end, but I like doing it at this time. I highlight here. I highlight my temples, not my cheekbones, my mistake. I highlight my nose. And like I said, I, like, I know people like doing this at the end, the highlighter in the cheeks. But I like doing it at the beginning because then I know what type of look I want to go for. And I know what type of look I want in my face. And if you can tell, I love highlighters. Highlight. And look how glowy, look how beautiful that is. Like, come on. 
look. I could stop here and just put mascara on, but I won't. Today, I have a look I want to do. Um, after that, let's see what I'm going to do to myself today. Ooh, I'm so excited to look into this. I'm just picking up the stuff. Sorry, guys. I'm picking up the stuff I want. Okay, so today I want to do like a purpley look. So, sorry guys, my stuff are like broken because my niece breaks it. And she goes into my makeup and she looks so cute and I can't say no to her. So, I'm using, this is the trade, I think, palette. So, the color I'm going to be using are today, it's called... Friends, no filter, and vamp. Those, these three colors right here. I'm gonna be using these three colors right here. So I'm gonna start off with no filter because we should have no filter. No jokes. We should have filter and be very careful in what we say to people. And what is being said to us and then over here if we don't like something we should tell people and we should defend ourselves and guys i'm sorry but i need to use a mirror for this to do my eyeshadow i need a mirror so so i'm still using no filter all over my eyelid And I'm going up my eyelid, if you could tell. Up my eyelid. On my eyelid. And don't, it doesn't matter if it looks messy, guys. Because I'm going for like a smoky look today. It's really hard doing your makeup and talking at the same time. So there, I'm still gonna go in with no filter. Brush it off and here. Up and down, up and down. So that's what I'll do with no filter. Now I do the other eye. Then right now I'm using frame um uh, fence and I'm going in at the bottom. And just blending it up. Blending it up. So it looks something like this. Yes, I use the same brush. Blending it up. Blending it up. Blending it up. Okay, so after that, I'm still blending it up. I'm blending it up. Okay. Okay. After that, I'll look 
and see. I look and see. I clean myself with my fingers, sort of, a little. Because if I feel I went too deep, I'll clean and use my fingers to like blend it. And I always use my ring finger. And the reason I use my ring finger is because my eyes and I don't want to pull a lot because the more you pull, the you get more, you will get wrinkles. So that's why I use my ring finger a lot. And then after that, I just blend, 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 blend. It's all about blending. Like with the smoky eye, it's all about blending. Blend, 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 blend. Blend. And then after that, I go like this. So I use that. Then I can actually use that. I use that for the bottom of my eyes. I blend it there and then I use vamp again for the next side if you could tell I went a little bit too deep here and then I use my ring finger to blend it up And then I do the same thing here. And that is how it looks there. If you can tell. And then I'm using this new product. I've never used it before. It's the Artistry Studio line. It's the same one as this one. And it's So let's see, guys. I've never used it before, so this is my first time using it, guys. So you and me are gonna be the first one seeing this. I don't know if I wanna do it as an eyeliner. What do you guys think? Okay, I'm not using it as an eyeliner. I'm just gonna put it under my eyelids. I'm gonna put it under my eyelid. I was thinking about it using it as an eyeliner, but I changed my mind. I decided to put it on my eyelids. I want a little pop of color. You guys could tell I'm using <sighs> so should have rushed. I checked with my brush and then I do this. Oh, I didn't stay. And then what I do is I go in with this color is the I go in with this color, the pink color. And I'm just gonna do the front. A little in the front. So you guys can tell like that. And then a little in this front. If you go here, and then after that, a little here, a little here. Sorry for the noise in the background. Those are my nephews. Um, 
in my house, no time is a good time to do videos. So I'll try my best, guys, to for it. But like I said, it's life of Anna. And then after I do this, I do this. And I do this. And if you can see. After that is done, after that is done, I clean my brush with a paper towel. I have a paper towel here. I clean my brush with a paper towel and I do my highlight. And you guys know I love using the artistry one. Um, I do, I do my highlight. Guys, I still need a I need I do my highlight and I do it here, 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 here. And this is the look. I'm not done yet. <laughs> oh wow, sorry. Um, after that, I have to really stop saying after that. I do my eyeliner. If you guys could tell, my eyeliner, I just go from the edge. And this time I'm gonna do it then. So I don't want it, it to take from the beauty of the eyes, of the eyes. So like that. I'll do the other side. Sorry, I'm very quiet when I do my eyeliner. I just don't want to screw up. And now I compare both of them. And that's how it looks. Just clean the excess follow. I add my artistry primer onto my eyes. My artistry primer. I go with my artistry at mascara. I'm having trouble. Yeah, girl, please look at this. Opening it. Like you guys know, I always like to start off with a small one. The small one because it has three. Like you guys could tell, it has one. It has one, two. It has two settings. One, two, three. I think it has three settings. This is three and one. 
it's three and one, so it has three setting. It goes from the smallest to biggest. After that, I add my mascara. I clean out the excess. I add my mascara up here, up here. Mascara time. And I go for the longest one to separate my eyelashes. At the bottom. And this is the final look, guys. What do you guys think? Um, let me see here. It looks so beautiful. I love, I feel so beautiful. It looks amazing. I feel gorgeous. Like, it goes in my hair. I just look amazing. Hope you guys like. Please like, subscribe, and comment below. And let me know what you guys think and what's the next look you guys want me to do. Guys, have an amazing day. Bye. Talk to you soon.